The Florida State University College of Education is a prestigious institution of higher learning with several nationally ranked academic programs designed to prepare students to be exemplary leaders in the classroom for tomorrow's generation. Florida State University has a very interesting history. It is a university but has been only since about uh, 1949 and prior to that it was a women's college. Uh, it was one of the first uh, universities established in the state of Florida and the College of Education at FSU is the second oldest college. Uh, so many of the alumni of the College of Education are in fact graduates of the Florida State College for Women. My research involves using well-designed games um, with some technology that I developed called Stealth Assessment, embedded deeply into the code of the games themselves. Um, and then these are used to accurately and engagingly measure and support 21st century competencies. Some of those are things like creativity and persistence and problem-solving skills and systems thinking, stuff like that. And so that's the basic way that the whole stealth assessment machinery works. FSU College of Education works with specialized populations uh, in various ways throughout the building. So in our special education program here, we focus a lot on autism. It's one of the few special ed education programs in the state that does that. Myself, I work in visual disabilities, and it's one of the few programs in the uh, country, actually, that, that trains people to work with children that are visually impaired, and it's the only one in the southeast U.S. The Center for Post-Secondary Success is a research center that was established in the college a couple of years ago by faculty members in our higher education program. And it really focuses on questions of uh, higher education policy and the impact that those have on student success in college. One of the, the relatively new initiatives that we're engaged in at the moment, we've been referring to it as our blackmail initiative, which is the question of how do we best help black males in America um, be successful in school and in post-secondary education? The statistics show as the, the higher up you go, fewer and fewer black males are actually engaged in, you know, graduate from high school, enter college, and become uh, college students. These are some of the kinds of work that we're doing now. If I had to sum up the most important qualities of the College of Education, I would say we're innovative, student-focused, committed to working with and improving our local community and the state, and education writ large.